The police are testing the use of advanced unmanned drones to help in their operations. The trial during the COVID-19 circuit breaker period is also timely when manpower resources are stretched. Gwyneth checks out how they're being used. These industrial firms have temporarily shut because of circuit breaker measures. Most of the workers here have also gone home. So these premises could become tempting targets for would-be criminals. While there may be fewer eyes on the ground on the lookout for thieves, there's definitely one in the sky. So I think during this COVID-19 uh, operation, police has also been offering our support to uh, other agencies uh, during this uh, difficult period for all Singaporeans. Uh, during, during, as we reorganise our resources itself, that's where uh, UAVs uh, are able to actually help us complement areas like for example the industrial estates that, that might be lower footfall during this period, but also we still want to enhance our presence in this area itself. The view from the drone is important to police because we want to have a very clear situational awareness on the ground. So in terms of the payload or the camera on the drone itself, it must be able to zoom in or to fulfill our requirements to see very clearly what is happening on the ground. There are some details that we are interested to see. The police have used drones before, but this time it doesn't require an on-site officer to operate this drone. It's all done from a back-end command and control centre. And as technology improves, the drones can even be flown without visual contact. This further reduces the manpower crunch, and flying the drones becomes easier as it requires less training. Unlike a conventional drone, uh, when you need a pilot on site to insert the battery, prep the aircraft um, from the very beginning until the end, with a drone box, uh, with a drone in drone box concept, uh, all these preparatory activities are actually automated away by the automation system uh, inside the drone box. So the operator, the officer, can focus on what's truly important, and that is to complete uh, the mission, the surveillance. Currently, this drone is being trialled in this industrial area in the western part of Singapore as it's an urban environment that's suitable for the purposes of the trial. But the police force says it's exploring the deployment of this technology in other industrial areas in Singapore.